you're at dinner. Katie, you're in. Mm -hmm. Yep. All right. Um, uh, Katie obviously helped you uh, the main priority. Enjoy here. dinner so and uh, like get a good night's rest and get ready for tomorrow. So, uh, to, to I love you. I'll talk to you tomorrow. I'm trying to see how it feels. Um, night, Before the game. Uh, physical stand part mentally, I was trying to play the back back in a long time. Uh, so just mentally getting prepared to try to play, not showing how you know foot's gonna react. Um, but I was able to get through the game. You feel like as of right now obviously. You feel okay? Uh, I've been better, but I'll be fine. So obviously not the result you guys wanted. Uh, what is there to be said about the reps, the opportunity for you guys to have your full squad and continue to kind of build here down the stretch? Yeah, um, you know, I think they came out, you know, well, I think they did come out very hot, you know, shooting the ball. Uh, so start for us, you know, obviously they, you know, been out for a couple of days. Um, you know, we went to overtime last night, not using it as an excuse, um, but that's kind of, I think that's what led to our slow start. Um, came out a lot of energy. Uh, you know, and then a game, you know, games where it's back to back, you know, you can't really you know, start slow. Um, you know, that's what we did. You know, missing shots, giving them open looks. Um, they would cut it back. Um, now you have to exert all the energy that you have to, you know, cut the lead down instead of pushing the lead up. Um, you know, that was the game. What did the process look like for you to? have the determination to go and now knowing the result what do you think the team gained by, by going forward with everyone even even if the loss was the result yeah um i probably had it in my mind that i was going to play regardless just because the game um you know but i think we gained uh more chemistry you know you know even not even though it's not the result we wanted you know we're able to get a healthy squad uh, even then you know mo didn't play you know just getting him back um, you know, getting all our guys back and healthy and uh, getting reps out on the floor um, for his last two games and then leading to uh, playoffs. You had won seven out of eight, and not that, you know, he was totally gone after tonight, but just, how does this sharpen everyone's kind of feelers for these final two? Um, like I said, just being at full strength and then two, you know, long road trip, you know, but I think I was at full strength. Uh, yeah, you know, beat anybody. Um, it was all really just about reps out there for us. And I think our guys are, um, you know, we continuously learning each other. You know, obviously guys are in or out, um, you know, and, and it's, it's tough to kind of get that continuity that you want. But um, like I said, this, this game, you know, you know, we lost, you know, you can look at it from you know, the other side of just getting reps with each other and you know, get more comfortable um, with our team and you know, it's going to benefit us down the line. Any the uh, Darwin was praising the group for how it still competed even through the adversity of you know the condensed schedule and facing different deficits in this game. How have you seen the group grow in that department in terms of handling challenges? Yeah, just keep fighting. Um, you know, resiliency. Uh, you know, you get down, you're down like 20 or 19. You know, just fighting back. Um, continue to take it one play at a time. Next play mentality. And um, like I said, a little you know, funky trip. You know, find all over the place, you know, getting stuck and weather and everything like that. But uh was able to come out, even though this was the last game on the road trip, technically. Um, you know, we just battled. You know, that's all we can do. Like I said, they came out shooting the ball very well. Uh, we started off slow, dug ourselves a hole, um, you know, missed some shots and turnovers. So it's always tough to win a game like that. But, uh, you know, I, um, I do agree, you know, with the way they were competing tonight. You know, they were waiting for this game. You know, you talked about what Eugene was on top of that. You knew Russ was going to have the, the boosters kind of lit. What did you see from him in those first five, six minutes of the game in, in terms of setting a tone for, for them? Yeah, uh, I think they got it, got them going. Uh, you know, he, I think he made two threes, made a couple pull-ups. Uh, you know, that's, that's an energy booster for them. Um, you know, we got, you know, I think our, our, our game plan was for him kind of, you know, shoot the ball. Um, and he made them. You know, he, he made the shots. Uh, like I said, and they kind of snowballed down to everybody else who started making shots. Um, got, their, got their crowd into it and everything like that. So, um, you know, hats off to him. This group hasn't had a, a ton of adversity. When it when it has kind of struck, how do you like the way this group has responded? Yeah, um, 
respond very well. I mean, you know, and through a course of a game. Uh, next game, you know, we lose. You know, our mindset is not to lose two in a row. Coming to the next game, trying to get a win. Um, you know, we just stay prepared. Uh, try to deal with adversity as best as, best as we can. Um, but I think our growth just through the course of the game has been, you know, very good. Um, you know, there's a lot of growth in that department. You know, not hanging our heads or getting down, you know, when teams make leads, knowing that, you know, we're just taking one play at a time and we can, you know, cut the lead down and get back in the game. So, like we did you know, tonight, um, you know, they just made a lot of shots. So, uh, we definitely have growth in that department. Does, Last it, does it feel like you guys have been playing playoff games for a couple weeks now? Uh, probably for the last month month and a half. Uh, every game has been important for us, climbing up in the standards, um, trying to get to where uh, we want to ultimately be. Um, for the last probably month, month and a half has, has been um, a very important game for us. What was the biggest difference with LeBron in the first half versus the uh, He's on his rhythm, um, making shots, going to the basket. Um, <coughs> Start limiting his turnovers and trying to, trying to make plays. Um, and turning it over, come out very aggressive in the second half. So um, I think that was the main difference. Thanks, AD. Thanks, AD. We're going to uh, Austin next. <laughs> Let's get ready for Hoop Jab.